So we need work on finishing, and um, it's something we've been focusing on in practice, and we're going to keep focusing on. I just think if we can score that goal a little bit earlier, it's a whole other ball game. But as far as playing soccer, I think the guys are playing really good soccer. Delran played solid soccer throughout Tuesday's Burlington County Scholastic League Liberty Division match with Burlington Township, but the finishing problems that Coach Mike Otto talked about were in evidence throughout. The Bears had a series of solid chances that went high, wide, or both in the first half. It was a particularly frustrating day for Delran's Tim Hunt, who had goals at both ends negated by offside calls. It doesn't feel good, but yeah, keep your head up and just keep on going until you score. Burlington Township's chances were sporadic, but the best of them went to Justin De La Pena, who took this pass from Jacob Beebe near the end of the first half and beat a defender, but missed the mark. But if we score the goal, if Justin scores before halftime, it's a different game entirely coming out in the second half. Would have been, you know, very exciting. I would have liked to have seen how that would have gone down, but unfortunately we missed, and you know, it's another one goal loss. We just have to, you know, just have to stick to our guns, keep fighting, and see what happens in the next one. It was the Bears' Sammy Santos who finally came through early in the second half. Uh, well, the goal was like 50-50 ball. And, you know, the biggest uh, ability that I have is hustle. And that's how I always score, by going to the ball 100%. Uh, we talked about it at halftime to just keep your composure, keep playing the way you're playing. And, you know, we got... 40 plus minutes to get a goal and just, you know, keep playing Dollar Ranch soccer. And I think they maintain that composure and, you know, the goal finally came.